All right, so today is the day that we get the car that is over there, which I will show you later, finally on the road. I'm just heading to the bank and then I gotta go get my appraisal and then we can go to the MTO and get it on the road. And I will see you there. So it turns out there's not really much to film when you get a car registered. So here it is. The second day I had the car, I did what every other new car owner does. I cleaned the living crap out of it. This car is immaculate, but the inside does need a little bit of work. I want to get a new center console, maybe some seats, a steering wheel, you know, all the essentials. After the car was clean, I ended up getting invited to go on a cruise with a few friends. One of those friends being Isaac. That's Isaac. That's his clean ass LS400. He helped me out a lot when it came to getting this car. Not only was he the one to drive the car back for me, he also came on a 10 hour road trip with me, which sucked. And the reason that it sucked is because Isaac and I thought we were checking out a clean car. The guy who owned this told me it was clean. Oh well. I ended up with an amazing car anyway, but whatever so day two ended off with a nice cruise with some pizza and just some hanging out which was awesome funny enough the day after that i met up with the same two guys to go on another cruise after they cleaned andrew's headlight oh yeah and this is andrew's subaru which is so fucking cool I'll do full car tours for both of their cars later on on this channel. But yeah, that day ended with us all meeting up with a bunch of people and going on a cruise taking some photos that you will hopefully see on my Instagram here at Z31 underscore Bailey. Thanks. Day 4 started off with uh, replacing a few things that I had noticed on the car including the original dome light. Uh, I just bought some LED replacements, they work super well. The way you do it is you just pop off this cap and then remove the old light bulb and pop your new LED in. There you go. I also threw on the shift knob I had from when I had a Miata. Uh, I'm definitely going to change this down the road, but for now, it's there. Day 5 and 6, I decided to fix the sunshade in the back of the trunk. I noticed it the day I got it and it kind of just bothered me. I found this perfect uh, duplicator vinyl fabric paint. It's basically spray paint and you'll see the result turns out really well. I also plan to replace all the carpet in this car one day. I also have a bunch of parts on the way including the whole timing belt ordeal, also some new speakers and uh, hope to bring you guys along for the ride. And day 7 I spent editing. Thanks. You know 